Just got a new controller. I want to know if it works with the amazing BJ Pro app. We're going to press the middle button. It's the same if you're in pro mode or if you're in any of the other modes. And then you're just going to have to go all the way down to the bottom right of this box. And it's going to say settings. We're going to our settings. This is a feature in our settings. And then we're going to scroll all the way down to MIDI devices. And now here it says supported DJ controllers, pretty self-explanatory. Press that. And then you get this list of about six of the, I guess, featured or most popular controllers that work with the app. But there are a lot more if you press view supported controllers. And now you're going to go to a landing page on the official algorithm website. And it's going to show you more of the featured stuff. But if you don't see your controller on this list, don't worry because this is the list that you can see all of the controllers. So what you're going to do is you're going to choose which device you're using. So it's going to start on the Mac. These are all the ones that work on the Mac. I'm not going to read through it all because you guys follow along and get to this page yourself. Uh, Windows, there's a good number of Windows. And then I'll get the iOS after. I just want to show you with Android. So this, these are the only controllers that work with a Android. Android has the most limited amount of controllers that work with the app. Now let's just see iOS. I assume most people that watch my videos use the app for the iPad. This is the list of all of the pre map controllers. So any of these controllers you could plug in to your phone or your iPad and they will start walking. They will start working immediately and be pre-mapped. So you don't have to do anything. You can literally plug it in and start DJing. And then also with these controllers, uh, you can map pretty much any button or knob. I made a lot of videos on how to map controllers. So all of these controllers are plug and play. But if you have a controller that is not on the list, just like I have that IDJ3 back there, that is not on this list. DJ Pro has a MIDI learn feature. So then you just have to plug the controller in and then go to the mapping settings. And then you could map this, the controller from the ground up and have it map the way you want it and use like cool retro controllers or pretty much, pretty much any controller will work this way. And then also if you're using the phone and it's not the giant one the, the plus like this then you might some controllers that are powered by the controller might require you to use the lightning to usb camera adapter which i'll leave a link down below so you could get get one of those connectors because some controllers like the newmark idj to go to are powered through the, the ipad or the phone and some phones don't have enough battery power to power the controller and the phone at the same time so let me know if you guys use any old school controllers that you map yourself and if you want to learn how to map controllers with this amazing app then check out one of these videos over here